Tonight, Memphis police are investigating six additional murders that happened in a matter of just a few hours over the weekend. Now, this is a problem. It's a huge problem. It continues to plague this city after a record setting number of homicides just a year ago or, or yeah, a year ago in 2020. Fox 13 Siobhan Riley got exclusive surveillance video showing what happened when a 20 year old man was gunned down in Frazier. Ironically, that uh, I posted about three or four days ago that I don't know who that's for, but if you have an infinity, you might want to consider selling it. Police say one of the six fatal shootings in the span of just a few hours about happened to next to Pastor Ricky Floyd's church down. at this gas station in the 3700 block of North Watkins in Frazier Saturday night. When my daughter texts me a post of a guy uh, who had got carjacked for his infinity, and then later I find out that it was at the gas station next door to the church. I got my hands on this exclusive surveillance video showing what led up to the shooting. You can see two people reacting after the 20 year old was gunned down. After the shots were fired, a man is seen running away and driving off in an infinity. I saw one of the videos that he was featured in and uh, we got to understand the importance and the power of words. And one of the videos he literally talked about uh, pulling up to the gas station and getting shot at. Six people killed in the city within hours apart. I don't think I've ever seen that in the city in years that I can recall. Just a tough situation for a young man who had a bright future in front of him. Uh, talked with somebody who was a um, uh, used to attend church with his mother and said that, you know, as a young child, he was very disciplined. That was Fox 13 Siobhan Riley reporting. The community leaders are trying to reach young men, and that's the group police say that really need to be addressed the most. So far, there have been 182 homicides in Memphis.